reading and writing fractions. And these are the learning targets. Read and write unit fractions. Identify other fractions less than one with denominations 10 and below. Read and write fractions. If we divide a home into two or more equal parts, what name can we give for each of the equal parts? How many equal parts do each of the two rectangles have? What part or fraction of rectangle A is color blue? And how about what part of fraction of rectangle B is color green? Think and understand. From the question, a unit fraction is the name of the equal parts of the numerator of a unit fraction is always 1. The whole is divided into three equal parts. One part is shaded. So one third is shaded. One One third numerator names the shaded part, and denominator tells the number of equal parts a whole is divided. Two parts are not shaded, so the unshaded part is two third of a whole and three third is the fraction name of one whole in the rectangle B there are five equal parts each part is one fifth of one whole. The shaded part is two fifth of a whole. Here are some examples of unit fractions. Check your understanding. Write the related unit fraction for each shaded part. Number one. One out of two equal parts is shaded. The fraction One half. In the number two, two out of three equal parts are shaded. The fraction name is two. And in the number three, three out of four equal parts 
sides are shaded. The fraction part is three fourth. Five four out of five equal parts are shaded. The fraction name is. Four fifth. Identify the fraction for the shaded and unshaded parts in each figure. Remember, fractions are part of a whole. The number above the line is the numerator. And the number below the line is the denominator. Thank you for listening. You may now proceed to your next task. Goodbye!